Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, how are you? Welcome to a new day, to another class. It is a big happiness for me to see you once again, to see that all of you are here and that all of you are fine. Okay. So we are going to be in white today. Yay. Okay. Good. So tell me a little bit of your day. How was your day? Good? Bad? So, so. How was your day? Good, bad, so, so. Good, good. Hey, that's very nice. The best part of the day is at eight <laughs> because we can see each other because we can have this class. Well, so I feel very happy that all of you are here. Well, I have 10 students. Hello, Gustavo. Hello, Ana Beatriz. Hello, Yari. Hello, Isaías. Hello, Marlon, Carlota, Veronica. Hello, Jairo, and hello, Jenny. Right? Hmm, they are going to be in the video as the first 10 students and Yolanda. Okay, and Yolanda, you leave it. The first 11 students of the class. Excellent. So I am very happy that you are here, that you have the opportunity to meet me again. Okay, so today is our class number three. My God, imagine class number three. Jesus, <laughs> time flies when you have fun. Uh, remember that we have classes tomorrow, right? Because of what I explained. It's the only Friday that I am going to steal from your life, okay? Es el único viernes que le voy a robar de su vida. Los otros no. Only this one, okay? Because of September 15. So tomorrow we have classes at the same time. The next Friday, no, right? You can go uh, to the pupuseria. You can go out with your family. You can do whatever you want. Next Friday. Tomorrow, no. <laughs> because you have classes. Okay, you have to be here with me for one hour, but you are going to be here, okay? So let's start. Today we are going to study a little bit more on the simple present, right? But we're going to go over the negative tenses and the uh, interrogative tenses as well, right? As you know, I am Natalia de Flores, your teacher. Right, so please remember the class agreements. And these are like the rules that we established at the beginning. I am going to read them every single class for us to remember them, okay? The first one, let me see. I am going to ask uh, someone to help me to read them. Mauricio, can you help me to read the first class agreement? Sorry, repeat me please. Okay, what is the first one? What is the first class agreement that we have? Can you read number one? Okay. Practice your English as much as possible. Okay, as much as possible. The next one, number two. Daddy, can you help me to read it? Yes, ask for help when needed. Ask for help when needed, very good job. Number three, Isaias, can you help me to read number three? Attend all your session on time. Okay, hey, you skipped number three. <laughs> number four, attend all your sessions on time. Very good. Number three, Gustavo, Sorry. help me with number three. Keep your cameras on all the time. Keep your cameras on all the time. And for sure, as we're going to keep the cameras on, we're going to keep the microphones off, right? Keep your microphones off if we are not using it, right? if we are not using them, okay? So that is rule number, that will be number four, right? Number five, attend your sessions of time. Number six, uh, Mr. Jairo, can you help me to read number six? Uh, participate as much as possible. Very good job. Number seven, Yolanda, can you help me to read number seven? Uh, 
Uh, Yolanda Jolivet, can you help me to read number seven? Oh, your microphone, honey. Uh, number seven. Yes. Keep a co cooperative uh -huh. attitude during class. Very good. Keep a cooperative attitude during class. And Ana Beatriz, help me with the last one, number eight. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Okay, on the WhatsApp group. So uh, I haven't seen a lot of activity in the WhatsApp group, right? I haven't seen a lot of activity, right? It is the first group that I don't see any good morning things. I don't see any messages during the day. There are, or maybe the other ones were very chachalacos, right? But the, in this group, I don't see any activity. So I am going to start in the morning, right? Hello, students in the morning to start having the conversation. Remember that the group is not for you to send memes or something. If it is of English, maybe yes, it's possible, right? Because even from English Corporativo, we receive memes, English memes. But, uh, but talk there in the group, you can practice, you can say like, uh, you can practice your English there. So keep uh, collabor collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Okay, so these are the agreements of the class. We are going to read them every day for you to remember. Them. So yesterday we were talking about what? What did we talk about in yesterday's class? My dear students, what did we talk about simple in the previous? The simple present, right? We talk about the simple present. And when you talk about the simple present, you talk about the changes that the verbs have. In which cases do you change the verbs? In which cases do we change the verbs? In the third person. In the third person, perfect, very good. So here I got the rules that we need to follow, right? These are the rules that we have been studying, right? For most of the verbs, you add S, right? For a CH, S, SH, X or Z, you add ES, right? And you have the examples here. Let me see. Daddy, can you help me to read the examples? Watch sería watches. Uh -huh. Verbo pass sería passes. Yes. Relax, relaxes. Yes. Rush, rushes. Rush, rushes. Very good job. Then we have that the verb that ends in consonant plus Y, you change the Y to I E S, right? For example, here you have a study, studies. And some verbs don't change because they have a Y and a vowel before. For example, in this case, you have the Y and you have a vowel. Okay, si tenemos Y y vocal antes que eso, only add the S. And the irregular forms of the verb, we have do, go, be, and have. Why be? Because it changes. Do goes, does. Go. Goes, goes, sorry, <laughs> my bad. Do, does, go, goes, be, it's going to be transformed for am, um, if you are talking about you, is, if you are talking about he, she, it, and are, if you are talking about plurals, and have, and has, right? That is the form of the rules that we have for the simple present, right? So far, so good? Vamos bien hasta ahí? Good. Yes, teacher, no, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Si no, no nos movemos. Uh, I have a question. Tell me, Roberto. Uh, siempre cuando es en plural, tengo que agregar la S, ¿verdad? Okay, no, this is for the verbs, ok, estos no son plurales ah. tenemos que acordarnos que los plurales se cambian los nombres 
¿ok? Objetos, la tele, la casa, el carro. So, those are objects, nouns. In this case, we are working with the verbs, right? Okay. It has the same rules because they are the same rules. Eh, si se fijan, tienen las mismas reglas de cambio que los plurales. Pero aquí no trabajamos con pronombres, trabajamos con verbos, ¿ok? And this is only for he, for she, and for it. Si tenemos las personas he, she, it, vamos a cambiar el verbo con estas reglas que tenemos aquí, Roberto. ¿Ok? Irregular form. Do, does, does. Yes. Ok, good. Yeah. And that's good. If you have questions, if you have doubts, that's perfect, right? We are talking about eh, simple present forms. Okay, and I gave you this example yesterday, right? I gave you this example. I work. Do I work? I don't work. You work. Do you work? You don't work. And here is the change that we were talking about. He works. She works. It works. Does he work? Right? Does she work? Does it work? El cambio lo hacemos con does. And for the negatives, doesn't. Okay, it doesn't work. I know that you work. My question is, where do you work? Where do you work? And I'm going to ask everybody this question. Let me see. I'm going to start here with Jari. That is the first one that I have in the camera. Where do you work, Jari? I work in Sportnight America. In where, sorry? Sportnight. Ah, in Sportnight, good. What about Isaías? I work at Alcaldía de Coluca. Okay, in the main hall of the Coluca. Good. What about Jairo? Where do you work? I work to uh, I work at Sportline. In a Sportline. Hey, you are co-workers with Jari. Yes. Hey, that's nice. That's nice. Jose, where do you work? Sport, sport light. Oh, in a sport, another co worker. Hey, that's fantastic. <laughs> that's very cool. Gustavo? I work in a sport line. Another co worker. Hey, but do you work in the same store? Están todos en la misma tienda? No, in different. Oh, Ana Beatriz, you work in a sport line too. I work in a sport line. Too. Oh, cool. <laughs> Kelly? I work in Sportline. Hey, so nice. I didn't know that. <laughs> Vanessa? Teacher? Yes? I work in Sportline too. Elmer? Hey, hey, so cool. That's very nice. I would like to have my co workers here in my class. Surprise. Surprise, surprise. Yeah, I didn't know. Vanessa? I work is Atento. Ah, in Atento. Yes. That's a call center, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Fantastic. Marlon? I work in Fruit, fruit of the Loom. Oh, fruit of the Loom in San Juan Opico. Mm, so, so, American Park. In American Park. Uh -huh, I know. I used to work in La Salle. Uh, okay. okay. But not in the factory, right? As a teacher. <laughs> let's uh. see. Uh, let's see. Moises, where do you work? Uh, I work in sport in America. I, I imagine. I imagine. <laughs> uh, you have the look. You have the look of a sport like man. Roberto? Uh, I'm, I work in Fovial. In Fovial. Hey, Emma, you are the one in charge of all the streets of El Salvador. Good. So yes. if, you if you have a problem with the street in near your house, tell Roberto. <laughs> Roberto, que hay un bache por mi casa. <laughs> Good. Yeah. And I am going to write your name here, Roberto Calderón. <laughs> Call Roberto Calderón. <laughs> Infobial. Excellent. Mauricio y Saúl, where do you work? I work in a Catholic school. Oh, and what do you do? Are you a teacher? Yes, I am, I am principal. The... And, and teacher. You are the principal. Mr. Director. Hi, yes, how are yes. you? Hey, my God, I am a principal too. 
but an, at an academy. <laughs> hey, that's very nice. Excellent. Hey, I have I have very prepared students here. That's fantastic. Elmer works at Sportline. Veronica. I work at Sportline. Sportline too. Eh? A surprise. Yeah. <laughs> How cool. Hey, Carlos Ernesto. I work in Sportline America. Yes. <laughs> How nice. Yolanda. Working a sport line. <gasps> Another one. Wow. Melvin. Melvin Perez. I work in Subway. In Subway. Hey, hey, what, a what a delicious job. And a question. Do you like Subways? Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> I am a technical support. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because they say that if you work there, then you don't like that much. But he works at technical support, okay? Salvado. Walter Samuel? I work in Sportline. Another one of her. Wow. Hey, Carlota? I work a school teacher. Oh, you are a school teacher. What is your subject? Science, mathematics, social studies, English. Ah. Basic. Oh, all the basic. Oh my God, my respect. My basic. respect. Yeah. yeah, everything. Science, social studies, language, everything. Wow, let me see. I'm missing Abdiel and Adriana. Where do you work? Mr. Abdiel. Sport. It's sport. Like, I don't know why. Yeah. I I imagine. <laughs> and Adi, Adi, uh, sorry, Adriana. And Fernando. I'm missing Fernando Merino. Sportline. Right? Sportline. And Fernando. Sportline. No, I uh, work in multi banquetes. Multi. Hey, another delicious job. Wow. Hey. Very nice to know that all of you work at the same company. That's very well. Most of you, that's pretty nice, right? Adopt the other ones that don't work in Sportline for uh, the, the job there in Sportline. How nice. Hey, that has been a very beautiful surprise for the night to have all the students from the different uh, enterprise. That's very, very beautiful. Thank you to your enterprise that supports your education. That it's very nice. Excellent. So, that answers the question, where do you work? And you say like, I work at, that's simple present. I am a, that's simple present. I am a technical support agent, simple present, right? Because they are activities, everyday things. And as you, I imagine that if I said, uh, give me a sentence in simple present, you are going to be like, Mm, I don't remember. But it's like, where do you work? Hey, I work at Sportline. I work here. I work at school. I am a principal. And you are producing sentences in simple present. Very nice. Hey, how good to know that all of you are partners. Okay, en los convivios, ahí se van a encontrar todos. Okay, let's go here. Here, we have uh, the sentences in simple present. And I have more examples, right? Um, you can you see the examples? Yes, right? Here it says simple present statements, and you have the sentences here. I walk to school, you ride your bike to school, he works near here, she takes the bus to work. We live with our parents, they use public transportation. These are affirmatives or negatives? Affirmatives. They are affirmative. affirmatives. Good. What about the next ones? We have other sentences right here. And it says, I don't live far from here. You don't live near here. He doesn't work downtown. She doesn't drive to work. We don't live alone. They don't need a car. Okay, they are affirmative or negative? Negative. They are negative, right? Because you make use of the auxiliary don't or the auxiliary doesn't. 
So here I have two sentences as an example. And in these ones, what we are going to do is that you are going to create an original sentence. Maybe you can use another verb, not the ones that we have here, but I need you to send me on the chat. I need you to send me a, a sentence on the chat using the forms that we have here. The first forms, it can be with I, you, we, or they. You use a verb every day. It can be, imagine that you are going to complement this one. I am going to use the verb um, cook. My sentence is, we cook every day, okay? So that's the sentence that I have to send on the chat. So I go to the chat and I say, we cook every day. And that's my sentence, okay? So I need everybody to go to the chat right now and send me a sentence using the base form of I, you, we, or they. Go ahead. Thank you, Gustavo. I drink much water every day. Everybody, send me a sentence on the chat. Si no pueden usar la, el chat de la plataforma, use the WhatsApp chat. It's okay. I have the two of them open. So if you cannot use one, I have the other one here. So you can use both. Okay, I dance every day. Good, very nice. I read emails every day, says Elmer. Good. I dream of being late every day. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> when you wake up and you think that it's very late. You are cook. In this case, uh, Vanessa, you say you cook every day. Because you are cook is tu eres cocina. I study every day. Good. I sleep every day. Very good. I run every day. Excellent. You cook every day. Good. I play video games every day. Hey, that's very nice. I drive every day. Excellent. Okay, and we keep on receiving sentences. I walk every day. I work on my computer. I drink meal. Excellent job. Excellent job on the sentences. Now we are going to do the next one with he, she, or it. For this one, remember that we need to transform the verb. And I say like he, she, or it. Um, let me see. Ah. Takes a shower, I am going to say. Okay. He takes a shower every day. So now I am going to send you my sentence. With he, she, or it. Send me the next one. I told you yesterday, today you are going to produce a lot. You dance every day. We dance every day. They dance every day. <laughs> hey, that's so cool. You use all the subjects. That's very nice. Thank you, Jari. It is very important to put a period at the end of the sentence, okay? Tanto en las oraciones normales como en la plataforma, la puntuación es importante. So, at the end of the sentence, put a period, okay? Siempre, si la plataforma no tiene el punto puesto, put a period at the end of the sentence. He takes a nap. Nap doesn't have an E, okay? She takes with S. He drinks beer every day. Okay, Fernando, that's cool. He watches television every day. Very good. Okay, she takes a nap. Good. She washes. Gustavo washes with ES. She washes her hair every day. Very good. She takes. Okay, in this case, Vanessa, you say she takes a sleep every day. Say she takes a nap or she sleeps every day. Okay, so change that one. So she sleeps every day. She washes her hair every day. Very good job, Gustavo, very good job. So that's the form of the sentences. 
That's the form of the sentences that we have. Now I need you to do something extra. The sentence that you just created with he, she, or it, we're going to make it negative. I say, he takes a shower every day. Let's make it negative. I'll say, he doesn't take a shower. He doesn't take a shower every day, right? Make the same sentence that you did with he, she, or it negative. So in the case of Vanessa, I am going to correct your sentence. It says like she sleeps every day, okay? Porque si tenemos she takes a sleep, tenemos dos verbos y eso no sería posible. And every day is with normal lower case. Okay, that's very good. So I can see you all send in the sentences and that's very good. Send me the same sentence, but in negative. She doesn't dance every day. Very good job. I have been thinking about this for two months. That is a present perfect progressive. I have been thinking. She sleeps every day. Good, very good. He doesn't live here. Very good. Now, Gustavo, open your microphone and tell me your sentence in negative. She doesn't wash her hair every day. She doesn't wash her hair every day. Very good. Let me see. Isaias, give me your sentence in negative. He doesn't study. He doesn't study, right? Doesn't. Very good. Uh, Adriana, give me your sentence in negative. Okay, we lost Adriana. Uh, maybe Moises Alberto, give me your sentence in negative. Uh, I. I don't take a bus every day. I don't take a bus every day. Good. I send a correction for watch. Watch is W-A-T-C-H. Let me see. Uh, Carlota, give me your sentencing negative. Okay, Carlota, please. Okay, we lost Carlota. Fernando Merino, give me your sentence in negative. I don't cry. I don't cry. <laughs> That's good. I don't cry because I am a big boy, you see. Very good. So, uh, Ana Beatriz, give me your sentence with he, she, or it in negative. She doesn't talk in public. She doesn't talk in public. Very good. Jose Moises, give me your sentence in negative. She doesn't listen to music. She doesn't. She doesn't, right? Remember? Doesn't with, uh -huh. listen to music. with uh she we use does. Good. The next one. Let me see. Uh, Kelly Maritza, please. Your sentence with he, she, or it in negative. She works TV every day. Oh, uh, she watch TV. Uh, she watches she TV. She doesn't. She okay. doesn't. She doesn't watch. Watch TV every day. Uh -huh. She doesn't watch. Remember that the auxiliary goes first, then the verb, and then the complement. She doesn't watch TV, TV every, every day. day. Very good job. I need two volunteers to read the sentences in negative. Teacher. Yes. Can I say he doesn't like to work? He doesn't like to work. Very good. It's a correct sentence. Very good. Another volunteer? Yeah, Vanessa, go ahead. Uh, she doesn't in the room. She doesn't what? What in is the verb? The room? 
room. Uh -huh. But it says, she doesn't in the room. But it's like, okay. she doesn't what? She doesn't clean, she doesn't sleep, she doesn't talk. She doesn't sleep? Uh -huh. She doesn't sleep in the room. Very good in job. In the room. Excellent job. Excellent job for the sentences. Reactions for everybody, please send some reactions there. Excellent job on the chat and excellent job on the sentences. Fantastic. Let's continue practicing then. We are in a very good track. Here, in this case, I have a good example. And for this one, we are going to work together. Remember that we said that for I, you, we, and they, we don't change the verb. For he, she, and it, we need to change the verb. Let's work on this one. I have a little exercise here. And uh, for this one, what I need you to do is I need you to choose an option, right? It says, let's pay attention to it. And I did the first one for you. I did the first one here. My family and I live. Why? Because I have my family and I. It's plural. We. Okay. Si yo estoy incluido en la oración, es we. Si dijera aquí, my family and my friends, they. But if I say my family and I, we, nosotros. Okay. My family and I live. Right? We use live because it's plural. Live in the suburbs. If I say the following, my wife and I live, work, work. work. These are the two options. Okay? Work. These are the two options. Work, right? My, my wife and I work, right? Work. Because it's a plural form. So we walk. walk. Very walk. good. So we walk to work. Or daughter, Emily. Or daughter, right? You are talking about works. Is she? It's a she, mm -hmm. right? Very good job. Mm -hmm. So you are talking about she works downtown. So she. Yes. Right drives to work or song or song we're talking about what uh, is or song he, he, he right it's he. he very good so in this case he doesn't he doesn't drive he right Right. He rides his bike to school. Quite, he rides his bike to school. So, in these cases, right, we have my wife and I live, right? Here we have this one, live. My wife mm -hmm. and I work. The next one, we walk, right? Our daughter Emily works. Work. So, work. she drives to work, right? right? Our son doesn't, doesn't. doesn't drive. He rides really? his bike to right. school. Good job. Now, let's do the next one. For this one, I am going to give you the opportunity to do it alone. And then I am going to ask for one volunteer each time. Okay? So, we are going to go here. This is number one, right? This is number one. This is number two. Ah, 12. <laughs> this is number two. I am going to move this number two because I don't like the place where it is. This is number two. This is number three. Okay, this is number three. And this is number four. And this is number five. So on your notebook, I need you to write number one and the verb. Number two, the verb. Number three, the verb that you are going to use, four and five. Go ahead. Okay. 
Okay, once you are ready, you can raise your hand and I can call for volunteers. Teacher. Yes? I have a question. Question me, go ahead. Eh, cuando es chosen es para he, she, en it. hi. It. It. Ajá. Y cuando es don't es, es for we and they. And I. I, you, we, and they. Okay. Good. So whenever you're ready, I am going to wait for your hands up for me to get volunteers. I need five volunteers. I'm a volunteer. Okay, Fernando, give me the first one. Then Isaías. I have two volunteers so far. I need three more. Three volunteers. Three, three, three. My parents. My parents. My parents. Mm -hmm. Lives in the city. Aha. Uh -huh. My parents. Plural. They. My parents. Do you use S with they? Lip. Aha, very good job. Okay, very good job. My parents live. My parents live in the city. Excellent job. Thank you, Fernando. Isaías, the second sentence. My mother takes a train to work. Excellent job. Very good job. My mother, she, third person. Very good job. The number three is going to be for Mauricio Isaú. Go ahead. My father is... Uh, so sorry. Uh, yeah, continue the sentence. How did you, okay. how did you say? How did you say? Uh, retire. Uh, retire. Retire. Okay. Thanks. My father is retired, so he doesn't work now. Very good job. He doesn't work. He doesn't. Very good job. Number four. Who is my fourth volunteer? Fourth volunteer. Number four. Three, two, one, dedo cratic. Ah, no, I have, I have, let me see. Let me see, let me see. No, I don't have, dedo cratic. Thank you, Vanessa, okay. number four. Eh, also, no sé cómo se dice. Um, he, also, also, he also, he also. He also uses public transportation. Very good. He also uses public transportation. Very good. And the last one, volunteer, Roberto Calderon. Thank you very much. Okay. So they. Yeah. Uh, so they don't need a car. Excellent job. So they don't need a car. Excellent job, my dear students, because for sure, a. Uh, that's the way we use it, right? In this form, parents, plural, you don't change. My mother, she, you have to change. My father, he, you need to change. He also, you change it. And they, plural, you don't change, okay? Two claps for all of you, very good job. Excellent job. Let's continue practicing. Do you want to continue practicing? No, teacher. Yes, teacher. Seguimos practicando o ya no seguimos practicando? Teacher, teacher. <laughs> yes. Teacher, I have a question. Yes. Um, se lo voy a decir en español. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> ¿Qué sucede? Que yo investigué y um, también se puedo, o oh, no sé si me adelanté la clase. It's okay. Pero está también eh, que se puede ocupar como, por ejemplo, he's not in the room, she's not my mother. Entonces no es si yo me confundí o me adelante. No, no it's okay. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. And I am going to go back to the first slide. Me voy a ir hasta aquí. Eh, that is a form of the verb to be. Okay. Mm -hmm. But it's an irregular form of simple present. Cuando decimos I am, she is, they are, it's also simple present. And you have it right here, right? I am going to show it to you. I have it. Right here at the end, am um, is are. They are also forms of simple present. So you are correct. That's correct. Good. And it's very nice that you did your investigation. That's awesome. Okay. Awesome. Very good. Let's continue then. So we were here, right? 
the next practice that I have here. These are the forms of irregular verbs that we have. That is the one that I was showing you right here, right? The irregular forms do, does, go, goes, be, and have, right? Now we are going to go with the irregular forms of these ones. How do you work with irregular verbs? In these cases, we have for I, you, we, and they, you use it in the normal form, have, do, and go. And for the he, she, and it, you have to change it and you have to use has, does, and goes, right? And in this case, for example, the verb to be in the original form is be, right? But you don't say, I be a friend. You say, I am a friend, right? You change it. You don't say, I be a student. No, you say, I am a student. You don't say, she be my teacher. You say, she is my teacher, okay? So that's the form of irregular verbs that we have here. And in these cases, we have different sentences. Let me see. Ah, a dog. <laughs> How cool, Vanessa. <laughs> you have a dog there. Let's. So let's, sorry. Don't worry. Don't worry. I love animals. Don't worry. Mr. Jairo, can you help me to read the examples that we have for uh, I, you, we, and they? These examples? Mm -hmm. Okay, I have a bike. Good. Next. Then, yes. Uh, we do uh, our homework every Very day. Very good. Excellent. My parents uh, go to work by bus. Fantastic job. Two claps for Jairo, people. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Va, lo, los aplausos son gratis. Vea, ¿qué pasa en este grupo? <laughs> Del aplauso vive el estudiante. Thank you very much. And the teacher, too. Let's see. Let's go here with um, Veronica. Can you help me to read the other the other examples? Here with he, she, and it. It is. Um, see my mother. Okay, but read the examples. My father <laughs> has. My father has a car. Excellent. The next one. My, la siguiente, ¿verdad? Yes. My mother does a lot of work and home. Very good job. And the last one. The bus go, goes, 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 goes. Goes downtown, right? Downtown. For this one, we have to open the mouth a lot and say like downtown. Downtown. <laughs> Very good job. <laughs> Claps, please, for your friend. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Requiere mucho valor el hecho de participar así de la nada. So, claps for your friend. That's very, very, very good. Thank you very much. Now, you know, you have seen the examples, right? Have is in the normal form. Has is for he, she, it. Do is in the normal form. Does is for he, she, it. Go is for the normal form. Goes is for he, she, and it. Okay? Now, let's do the examples. For this one, I am going to give you some minutes and I am going to send you to work together. Okay? So, moment of screenshot. A screenshot moment. Go ahead. Momento screenshot, porque vamos a los grupos. Se tienen que llevar el ejercicio. <laughs> Momento screenshot. No? Yes? You have it? ¿Ya le tomaron foto? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. I am going to send yes. you to work in the groups and you are going to work together, okay? We're going to have very, very, very small groups. So you can have the exercise all together. How are you going to do this? You are going to complete the sentences with, for sure, the correct form of have or has, go, goes, or do and does. Let's go to this mini groups right now. Let's go to work. Hey. 
Excellent. All my students are in the different rooms right now. They are going to do their exercise. So I am going to go and check each of them to see how they are doing. I am going to give them some minutes for them to set up. And then I am going to enter to each room to see how they are doing it. Let's go to the different groups. Uh, a house in the sewers. ¿Cuál pusiste ahí, Moico? How? La primera ya está, que es my parents have a house in the sewers. My mm -hmm. mom and dad go. Go downtown, downtown to work. Downtown. My parents very, very boys. Remember so, the word downtown? downtown. <laughs> For downtown. this one, hello group. For this one, remember that you have to open the mouth like downtown. Downtown. <laughs> you see, you have the correct pronunciation. Downtown. To work. downtown. My, it's like my parents. My parents. Uh -huh. My parents. My parents. 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 Okay. Parents. Con el inglés nos tenemos que despegar un poco ahí la boca porque si imagínese si usted dice downtown, no nos sale. It's downtown. Downtown. Very parents good. Parents is parents. 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 Okay. Uh -huh. Continue Dale. working. Continue working. My parents are very good. So I do a lot of work. Isaías inicial. Okay, my parents have a house in the suburbs. My mom and dad go downtown to work. My parents are very busy, so I do a lot of work at home. Okay. So you're segundo. Okay. Uh, my brother doesn't live with you. He has an apartment in the city. In the city. In the, in city. the city. Hey, okay. what, a, what a nice <laughs> picture of me. I can have a memory with that. <laughs> <laughs> the city very nice yeah very nice uh -huh. remember my parents my parents in the suburbs in the suburbs right in the suburbs and downtown the pronunciation continue working i'm going to go to the next group okay he goes to a school all day and and he does office Office work at night. He goes, he goes, and he, he goes. does. Okay, now I leave. Okay, continue, continue. Okay. Okay, son goes. Las dos creo que son goes porque habla de él o de un grupo. Goes, goes. Ah, por eso. Goes, goes is gobierno del Salvador, right? Goes. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, he say goes, goes, oh. the pronunciation. Oh. Hey, you are a very organized group, my God. Mm. I like it, I like it. <laughs> okay, continue it's working. Uh -huh. we continue, I am going to go and check the next group. Great job. Did he says did he says she has a <laughs> she, she an apartment she has apartment in the city dijiste verdad in the city cabal y la última porque creo que ya no ya no vamos a alcanzar yeah he, you can do it continue he, he goes he, he goes to a school all day and he does office he work does. at correct Thank you. 
Excellent job, students. Excellent job. Continue working. I'm going to go to the next group. Yeah. Did you finish? Yes, yes sir. Very good. You are very quick. Uh -huh. Teacher, but, but I have a, a question. What is the question? Um, for example, Mauricio to, told me or to, told us. Um, told us, you say. He told talk. us. Told, told us. us. Uh -huh. um, 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 how do you say? Um, estamos de acuerdo. And I told him uh, we are agree, but I don't know if we agree or we are agree. Okay, you say like, uh, if I say like, do you agree? It's like, yes, I do. That's the answer. If you tell me, hey, people, do you agree? Yes, I do. Or you say, I agree with you. I agree with you. Yo estoy de acuerdo contigo. You don't have to say, I am agree with you, porque eso es incorrecto. La frase es, I agree with you. Yo concuerdo contigo. Okay. So you say, I agree with I, you. I agree with you. Uh -huh. I with agree with you. you. With, with, you. Okay. with you. Okay, I agree with you. Or you say like, do you agree? Yes, I do. Simple but as that. If, if I want to say uh, all, all are agree. Ah, we, like, we all agree with you. Okay. Todos estamos de acuerdo contigo. We all agree with you. Okay. Uh, I am going to go to the last group and we're going to go back to the main room. Prepare your answers, please, because you are going to use them. Let's see. Uh huh. Did Hi. you finish? Hi. Yes. <laughs> I, I just love the pictures that I have in all the screenshots. <laughs> Hi, <laughs> yeah, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> no, but it's fun. Cheese. You you say cheese? Cheese. Yeah, cheese. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Too. That's my favorite part of the screenshots to see my expressions. Oh, okay. Yes. I, I always say that I am I am a good a good uh, product for stickers because I am very expressive. Okay. Yeah, I'm always like ah, ah, ah making faces and all that. So I have a very good nice a good good thing there. That can be a good sticker. They're like shh. Yes. Siéntese, señora. Be quiet. No estaba diciendo. Did you finish? Yeah. Yes, okay. Yes, good. Yes. Let's go to the let's go to the main session there. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Ay, no le oigo, teacher. Welcome back. <laughs> ¿Y ese es el secreto de la felicidad? What? <laughs> Because my microphone was off. What? Yeah, mi micrófono estaba apagado y yo dándoles el secreto de la vida eterna. Contexto, please. Which? <laughs> no, sí, que, contexto, por favor. que todos entraron y yo estaba hablando y hablando y hablando y hablando, pero mi micrófono estaba apagado. Y entonces cuando lo abrí les dije, y ese es el secreto de la felicidad. <laughs> But you didn't listen. <laughs> What is the secret of happiness? To know Excel and English at the same time. <laughs> That's the secret of happiness. No en sé. Teacher, pero me solo en la sala. Oh, really? <laughs> hey, come on. Si hubiera uh... venido, aquí estábamos todos. Sí, me quedé solo en la sala. Ay, ¿con quién estaba? No me acuerdo, la verdad. ¡Amiga! Es... ¿Ah? With Kelly. Ok, so, let's check on the exercises, my dear students. Let's see. I need volunteers. Well, I think everybody has the answers. So, everybody open the microphone. Everybody open the microphone because everybody has the answers. 
I am going to read the sentence and I'm going to stop in the verb, okay? My, okay. my parents have a house in the suburbs. My mom and dad. Go. Go. My mom and dad, plural. Go. 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 Downtown to work. My parents are very busy. So I do, do. I do Go. a lot of work at home. My brother doesn't live with us. He has. has an apartment in the city. He goes. 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 To school goes. all day. And he does. 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 Go. We, go. To the same school. we go to the same school and sometimes we do, do. Homework, do. Together. Or homework, homework together. together. Exactly no. like my students, okay? No. no. Now, <laughs> <laughs> now, a little secret. These are the exams that you are going to find in the platform. So, you have the answers already, okay? Si ya los hicieron y no se sacaron 100, lo pueden ir a repetir porque ya tienen the complete exam. Good. Exactly. Let's continue here. Here, just for us to continue in context, right? I have some more examples for simple present. And I need Isaías to help me read the first examples. This I is. watch a movie with my family every Friday. Very good. Number two, Ana Beatriz. He watched TV with his wife every night before bed. Very good job. Kelly, number three. The, boy, the boys catch with flies. flies. Net. With nets. Good. Vanessa. The boy catches butterflies in the garden in the afternoon. Very good job. Carlos Ernesto. Nick and Sin wash their clothes together. Very good. Sean, in this case, as is in English, Sean. The next one, Jenny. Nick. Nick. Wa Nick. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sorry. Nick. Wash. Washes. Washes the dishes. Uh, while while his sister uh, brushes her hair. Her hair, very good, her hair. Mauricio. The girls do their homework before bed. Very good job. And the last one, Jose Moises. The boys does his homework before bed. Bed, before bed. bed. bed good, bed. very good. The boy does his homework before bed. Excellent job, everybody. Thank you, volunteers. Thank you. Del aplauso de los estudiantes. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Now, we go here, right? Just to make it in context. Remember, we said that the negatives are you, we don't. The he, she, it doesn't, right? That's for you to keep in mind. For the questions, just for you to remember, you use do with I, you, we, and they, and does for he, she, and it. These are for questions, right? The questions, the auxiliary first, then the subject, the verb, and the complement. That's for you to refresh only. Now, these are the verbs that we created yesterday, right? With these ones, you can have ooh, a lot of examples, right? Similar sentences to the ones that we just created. Now, as uh, we are here, we are going to finish the night working as a team, right? This is teamwork time. I am going to give you some minutes for you to discuss, right? Todos pueden abrir el micrófono y va a ser una discusión grupal. What verbs we are going to use to work here, okay? Y necesito a uno que pueda anotar en la presentación. ¿Quién tiene esa opción en Zoom? 
Ay, Oye, vos a nivel <risa> Ok, aquí donde sale quien está compartiendo, donde sale quien está compartiendo, le dan más opciones. No sé si le sale a ustedes. Sí. Ajá, ajá. Y ahí sale una opción que se llama anotar. You got it? No? Ok, Roberto, tell me. Es como un lápiz que está arriba del Ajá, micrófono. Exactly like that. You have it. Bolígrafo. Ajá. Sí. Bolígrafo, flecha, color. Ok, good. Ok, so Roberto, Roberto va a ser el encargado de escribir. <laughs> ok, okay. group. Give the answers to Roberto. What you can do, Roberto, is that you can mark. That you can. Ajá, Sorry. exactly. Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry. You can mark the option. Okay, so group, help Roberto. He has an apartment near He's, here. He has. Uh -huh. He has. He has. has. Okay, Roberto, has. marca ahí, has. Has. Sorry, lo hago al pulso. <laughs> you want. Continue. You want, you want to work. Continue, Roberto. Sigue la marcando. Ahí te la van diciendo. The morning I take I take I take I walk okay thank you Roberto thank you claps for Roberto okay we are going to continue with the next one tomorrow because the time is over and I have the next class okay my dear Teacher, students yes I have a last question go ahead last tell me classes son de lunes a viernes o de lunes a jueves okay good question las sesiones son de lunes a jueves pero ah, okay. el día de mañana por el día 15 de septiembre que no vamos a tener clases es eh, la razón por la cual nos vamos a reunir el día de mañana. ¿Ok? Ay, Para... no vamos a reunir mañana. <ríe> Ay, come on. No me quieren ver. <ríe> Ay, no, but it's because if we do it in September 15, no sé si quieren reunir el 15 de septiembre, el día de vacación. No, porque no. vamos a ir a desfilar. <risa> no, eh, eh, por eso el programa se corrió hasta hoy día viernes, pero pues las otras semanas, cachiporra. las otras, sí, vamos a hacer de cachipor. Las otras semanas es solo de lunes a jueves. El único viernes que me lo voy a robar, lo siento familias, es una hora nada más, es el día de mañana, ¿ok? O sea que, o sea que vamos a descansar el 15 y el viernes también. Yes. 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 Claro que yes. Okay. <laughs> See you tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow. Friday, Saturday. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye.